And today, volunteers came from across the Arklatex to help clean up damage in the area following last week's severe storms. Now, KSLA's News 12 Jasmine Franklin spent the day shadowing these volunteers and she joins us here in the studio tonight. Jasmine, how did the community handle this cleanup? How did the cleanup go today? Yes, Angelia, it was a really positive story right here. Volunteers from across the Arklatex traveled to the Shreveport Bossier area to clean up the community following last week's damaging storms. Volunteers from the Home Depot Foundation and Team Rubicon partnered up to take action. To continue helping these Shreveport Bossier citizens remove the debris they can't afford to pay someone else to do. Thousands of people are still without power across the Arklatex, and many are still recovering from last Friday's damaging storms. Uh, an opportunity for us to, to show, to give back to them, give back to the community, give back to our customers. Dozens of volunteers from the Home Depot Foundation and Team Rubicon joined forces to clean up areas still impacted from the storm. Um, today we're at this homeowner's house. He had a large tree fall on his trailer. Luckily, someone came out and got it off of his trailer, got the tarp up, and we're removing the rest of the tree in his backyard. Both teams spent the day clearing debris and sawing fallen trees at people's homes across the area. The areas in their homes livable, you know, so they can at least get into their yard, into their driveways. Because the trees that we cleaned, what they were blocking driveways and stuff. Many volunteers say they experienced the storm themselves, but they still felt inclined to help. I didn't have electricity, Sarah didn't have electricity, um, but our homes were fine and our families were fine. Um, and what else was there to do but help other people who needed to get back in their homes? Now, residents receiving help from those volunteers were extremely appreciative being assisted, especially during a time of need. Now, both Team Rubicon and the Home Depot Foundation say they plan to continue assisting communities impacted by storms and natural disasters with future volunteer cleanup days just like today and the near future. Now, you can find more information about volunteering with organizations on our KSLA News 12 app. In the First Alert Center, Jasmine Franklin, KSLA News 12.